come this way. The Northwest Territories government wants to entice more first-time farmers. Right. Welcome to my garden. Like Jana McKay. She has a garden plot at Anubik's greenhouse. Very first attempt, other than like trying to grow a green bean in grade three. The hope is more gardeners means more food to bring down the North's skyrocketing grocery bills. If we can replace or reduce the cost of food through agriculture in the Northwest Territories, that's keen and critical. Each year, Colford says the Northwest Territory spends about $160 million on groceries. That money could be going to local farmers and gardeners instead of outside corporations. Not only is it fun to do, but it actually has a financial gain for them. Uh, there's a lot of chances for us to increase our food yield ourselves instead of having to rely on trucks. So it's very exciting to think of what could happen up here. But the growing season's short and not everyone is prepared to put in the time, money and work. Oh, those were a little small. It takes to grow your own food. Uh, not in the winter, I don't think so. I, I tried even growing flowers inside the house and they don't like me. The campaign will promote the equipment and workshops the government already offers gardeners and farmers. And the government is already looking at what else it can do to make local food production more appetizing. But for Jana McKay, she's already convinced. The output from the, our garden here, we definitely um, had a bit of a cost savings aside from buying something at the grocery store. She'll be back next year. David Thurton, CBC News, Inuvik.